But uh, I must say, uh, uh, this looks very promising, no? Yeah. Over this past summer, our group traveled around Italy studying material science and art, architecture, and archaeology. We stopped in Rome, Sermonetta, Torino, and Aramango to meet with professional restorers, chemists, archaeologists, and artists to learn about current challenges facing the preservation of cultural heritage, as well as recent developments in solving these problems. One such challenge that caught our attention was the degradation of calcium carbonate stones, like marble and limestone, caused by acid rain. We first noticed this problem on marble sculptures while touring the Vatican Museum. We decided that we wanted to investigate this problem by aging calcium carbonate in a solution of sulfuric acid. We prepared a solution of sulfuric acid that had a pH of 1.4 and left our samples in the solution for 4, 8, and 12 days to simulate 40, 80, and 120 years of aging. Over the course of our aging process, we recorded the temperature and pH of our solutions every day. We then examined our final samples using scanning electron microscopy to record the changes in elemental composition, specifically the penetration of sulfur into our marble and limestone samples. We also decided to try to computationally simulate the reaction between calcium carbonate and sulfuric acid using VMD, or visual molecular dynamics. As archaeologists and engineering students, our project gave us experience in on-site recording methods like photogrammetry and DPI. In the lab, our project allowed us to gain experience in using different lab tools like wet saws and pH meters, as well as observational, computational, and modeling techniques like VMD and SEM-EDS. We were able to apply these techniques towards exploring a global challenge of acid rain and its consequences for the further preservation of cultural heritage. Thank you.